If insufflation fails, check. Is the air pump switched on, or the CO2 cylinder on and full? Or has the umbilical pulled out, which disconnects the air supply? Is the water bottle cap screwed on tightly? In older scopes, is the water bottle connector pushed in, and is there an O-ring present? In newer scopes, the twist connection avoids this problem. Is the air or CO2 valve fully pushed in, or is the button stuck down, needing to be pulled up again and removed for lubrication or a replacement valve fitted? Is the biopsy cap missing, which lets the colon deflate, or is it damaged and leaking? If none of these checks finds a fault, there may be a blockage at the scope tip. Try forceful syringing with the channel flushing device. If all else fails, as an emergency measure, emptying the water bottle of water and using full pressure on the water button will then insufflate air successfully down the water channel. If water wash fails, and there's water in the bottle, check that the cap is screwed tightly. Then temporize, either by using the flushing syringe on an older instrument, or using the channel flushing device, if that's available. As a last resort, it is possible to syringe flush up the water bottle tube, remembering to push the water button at the same time. If suction fails, but suction's audible at the scope, release the biopsy cap to free any mucosal suction bleb. Take out the suction valve and try occluding the hole with a finger, which should free any debris in the channel. Next, take a 20cc syringe and flush water down into the colon, which should clear the channel. If suction fails and isn't audible at the scope, check that the suction has been switched on. Then feel directly on the suction tube. Is the vacuum arriving at the scope? If there's no vacuum, is the suction tube kinked or the suction bag full or faulty? If there is vacuum, is the suction button jammed down? Or is the suction valve blocked or faulty, needing replacement? If all checks fail, the final resort is to water flush back through the suction port on the umbilical with a 50cc syringe, either removing the suction valve and flushing into a container, or with a finger over the suction valve hole, flushing all the way down the channel and back into the colon.